Folks, welcome again to St. George, Utah Helicopter St. George. My name is Mike, this is Jake. Jake will be recording our conversation today. Today's topic is going to be physical states of moisture. As a pilot, you're going to fly through a lot of different kinds of moisture. I'll show you the three states of moisture. We have solid, liquid, and gas. I suppose we're pretty familiar with those. Solid would be anything like ice cubes. In aviation, you're going to have things like hail, ice storms. Liquid, going to be anything like rain and gas. You definitely have uh, water vapor in the air that uh, we fly through as well. Now, in order to move between different states, you have to have, a ch have an exchange of heat. Okay, Whether we're, we're getting rid of heat or we're adding heat, that's how we move between the three states. So if we want to move from a solid to a liquid, it's called melting. We have to add heat in order to do that. If we want to move from a liquid to a gas, again we add heat, and people know it as evaporation. If we want to move from a gas to a liquid, we've got to cool it down, condense it, or condensation. And to move from a liquid to a solid, again we have to get it colder and freeze it, or freezing. The other two are a little bit more difficult to remember and a little bit more difficult to understand. If you want to move from a solid straight to a gas, it's called sublimation. Uh, dry ice is a really good form of those. And if you want to move from gas to a solid, deposition is the other one on that one. That would be frost on your uh, windows in the morning when you go out to scrape them. So hopefully that helps you to understand the different physical states solid liquid gas and how you move between each one of them.